Good morning, beautiful people. How are you doing? Me and Carla was just having a discussion about just the struggles right now. Like, okay, other people who are in their trucks, let me know if you're having the same struggle. So right now, currently in this morning, it is cool. Woke up, our bodies were cold, and you know, you, but when we went to sleep last night, it was hot. So it's like we're kind of having the fluctuation of the temperature. One minute it's being cold, one minute it's being hot, and it's hard to maintain the temperature in the truck. Um, and I think that's having a negative effect on our bodies because you know the temperature going back and forth. I don't know if you ever heard when the temperature start getting cool, <sighs> you got to be careful um, because that weather is tricky and it can throw your body off. But yeah, so woke up this morning, which is a blessing. Uh, we have a pretty, I think it's maybe a pretty short day today. Um, let's see here. Hold on. Damn. Is that saying my pickup 17 miles away? You know, Carla, I think it's based off of the way we leave out of here, which makes it so. Because look, the destination is right there on the map. But I guess because of this rest area and the way it got us positioned, um, it adds, it makes it 17 miles. Oh, that's so annoying. So with that being said, gotta go. I gotta go. All right. So I've made it here with two minutes to spare. Got this, baby. Yeah, we were just here two days ago, or however many days ago. All right, guys, so we've made it, um, and it, we're, I'm pretty much getting loaded right now. I'm not sure how well y'all can see that, but um, I'm in the dock door getting loaded. And I don't know if I really gave y'all details of the load. It's a pretty simple load, as you can see. Uh, I only have 277 miles to drive. As a matter of fact, I need to put it in this GPS, too. But, um it's a pretty simple day unless something else come through uh carla she won't even work today so we pretty much just <laughs> joking trying to make the best out of today and just you know just getting through it but um other than that i guess we'll take y'all along with us but we're uh here currently in new york and uh, it's like rent a sailor i i can't really say i'll put it on the screen um maybe somebody can break the word down for me or because i don't feel like looking it up i could look it up but i don't care that much um and we're headed to manchester pa so that's where we're headed um regular low not has matter or anything and uh that's pretty much it guys all right guys so we are all loaded up and we are getting ready to head on out. We got Carla behind the camera. She either gonna be silent or she gonna speak to y'all. Hmm, what is she gonna do? All right, I guess that's her answer. She is she not a morning person. You can't force her to speak to you guys. Hey, show that building bag. It's like they tear down that building. You can't even see it. The sun. Yeah, look, they tear down that building. I guess they building something new or replacing it. I don't know what they doing. That's something you don't see every day. I always wonder how it was for them guys working out there, you know.
it looks like they are done loading us. That's why the light is green, as you can see. Um, what they did was they actually opened the door from the inside. So I had to back all the way up. They broke the seal and everything. It was a very quick and easy load. We actually have another load that came through where um, we got to get ready to drive 383 miles to Ohio so we can drop in Michigan. So I guess we do have uh, another load that came through before the weekend. We are currently in Troy, Michigan. Uh, this was that other load I told y'all about that we got at the last minute. Carla, she got up early in the morning, like four or something in the morning, and um, got the load and dropping it off now. Since it's the weekend, today is Friday, we actually said that um, we need to do our laundry. So I found us a hotel room so we can get out and we can just do our laundry, take a break from the truck, stretch out, all that good stuff. So. After we drop this load, that's where we'll be headed. Oh my goodness, you guys. So we finally got our stuff and we're getting ready to get checked in. Bad lady. You gon' hurt your back Carrying all those bags like that You got more than me <laughs> I know I got more But you ain't got no mask on or nothing I'd rather really have all these bags oh, and have my bag <laughs> You got a key You trying to see if you got an emergency mask Yeah, you so I try to keep it in here I think I done gave it to them daggone kids Honey, here go the keys. Don't y'all just hate when you forget something in that truck? Now you got all them bags, man. Here, hold this no. Oh my goodness. I'm getting punished because she forgot her mask. Bag lady, you gonna hurt your back. Carrying all those bags like that. She said, I can twerk with the bag. What you talking about? All right, y'all. Now, since Darth Vader got her life together, babe, get this water, please. Did you say Darth Vader? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> I messed up. <laughs> How many of y'all caught that? Carly, you is so petty. I know. <laughs> Darth Vader. Now, since Darth Vader got her mask on. <laughs> <laughs> we can go ahead and check out this hotel and see what it's looking like. It looks really nice on the outside. It's very empty, but that's how I like it. We got the whole hotel. I booked the whole hotel for us, babe. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, okay. Well, we gotta go to the Shows for us. I told you I booked the whole hotel for us, honey. No, what's the problem? Please, no. Oh, my goodness. I hope it wasn't because I put my cell phone. It probably is. You dropped both of them. Yes. Oh. Okay. Guess I gotta go back. This yep. sucks. That's instant karma. Charlie. <laughs> 
I told Carla I actually want us to get out the room this time and maybe try to explore the hotel, the area or something. So hopefully we can get out this time. Hey, my um cars don't work. Could be because I had it on my cell phone. Thank you. Let's see if Carla's gonna be petty when I get out the elevator. Let's, let's, if you think Carla's gonna be petty, comment below now if you think she is or if you think she's not. Let's see if she passed the test. We're gonna test Carla right now just to see how petty she is. Let's see. the right room. I thought you was going to come and be like, we was at the wrong door. Hmm. That's all you got to say? Yes. Oh, you passed the test. What? We was testing you. We was trying to see how petty was Carla going to be when I came back up. <laughs> I what I it's still in. This is right, right? 515. It ain't working. Am I doing something wrong? Is this one of the most fancy smashy hotels? This is the right, okay, 515, 515. It sounds like it's on lockdown though. Is it? Oh, it worked the whole time. <laughs> it worked the whole time, Carla. Okay, get your stuff. You still ain't being petty? Oh, no, nah, you showing up for the camera now. No, I'm not. <laughs> All right, let's see what we're working with with the room. Oh wow, I did not expect that. There go our truck right there, guys. Let me give y'all a full view. And let's see what the bathroom look like. I ain't never had the bed just smack dab in the mirror in the middle like that. Got a little desk area right here. Patrice had got me a room downtown. Really? And um, okay. that's you know, she was from what was she, North Carolina? Mm -hmm. And it was really nice, like this. Yeah, got the glass shower, like I like it. Yeah, all right. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> 